londe underscore sma. Au pume la gui la eve yamu ya nginzo sisi. And then bese uya gui wole yami. E itombe ni engi postile. E itombe ni ngfage ingubo. E, e aga ala bananza fashion boutique e red and white. La pe ngfage kona lo ngubo. Nga tati skatsan. Nga tati mali yami. Nga shone Cape Town. Ngaya on a holiday. Yang is wagash. Mang figure on a holiday. Bengaz go to one of the days in Gizuenza. If photo shoot langs on ok la corner. Ngum zimba wam. Owe maliam. Tati photo shoot. Kabizi makeup artist. Photo shoot wa shoot on fano kokele im. Wa editi tombe. Ngatati data lam gatati phone yam. Cash. Ngafaka ku Instagram, ngafaka ku Facebook, ngafaka ku Twitter. Nga posta the journey about my body. Nga teka abandaba ngisizile ngoku achieve close ngoba sasebenza to my body. Nga sengina meka ku social media, nga share ukuthi i journey yami ku hambe kanjani komzimba. Manje amangala when I saw my body that I am getting closer to like the body of my dreams. Do you understand what I'm saying? Let me go to Cape Town with my money. Let me buy a dress with my money. And let me take time when I get to Cape Town one of the days, I'll have a photographer. And that photographer I will pay and that photographer will choose I will choose a dress because I'll be sharing my journey. I don't have to, but I'll share my journey and I will take time, I'll do the photo shoot. I will uh, I will I will I will pay a photo shoot, I will pay makeup artist. Do you understand? And I will post and I will share my journey. Do you understand what I'm saying? And I took my time, my phone, my data, and I posted and I my fingers, my energy and my mind to articulate my journey so that you try and have an understanding or you have a clear picture of where have I been with my body. And with all the efforts and the energy, I put it on my Instagram, I put it on my Facebook, my personal people on WhatsApp, they've seen it. I've sent it, I've posted it. I'm a bloggers on Ondaba. They took, they took the, what I posted. They made news out of it. They say, I am deeply disappointed that on the 26th of December, there are still people who are still asking me, what did I do with my genome? Imagine the honesty in it, the efforts in it, in sharing there are still people who are still my fingers of typing my my mind because I need I don't just write captions. I mean I I don't just write things to sound okay. I put my heart to it. So it's, there are people who are Kuri every post. Are you big for real? Every post that I post, there's someone who ask me, and then there are people who said, yeah. Eh, she's wearing a corset. Besha. Umte shuswa yi nito zake. Na yunga mazut. Aitenga ni corset. Pela if I wear a corset. If you wear. There's a difference. I'm wearing what's called a body garment after a lipo. That. That. Eh. 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 It sort of nurses and heals your skin. Because your skin is wound. Augu tateke. Wear nu corset. Utate whatever that you think I wear. Because there's a difference in wearing a body garment to heal your skin and wearing something to try and build shape. Emma Fulton. Please. I beg. So I was still talking. And this life, the whole purpose of it 
was to be grateful and share ugutigene where have you been and what are you grateful for for 2022 instead of this car but say little on the journey and that's why i shared do you understand that's why i shared my journey so that thing i libeling hanging means you know there's a group of friends uh, there's a group of friends i went to Oh, Tasha, some in Pretoria, all meets ladies, and they're like, Ay, Bola, see, please come here. We need to talk to you. I'm like, Yeah, but do I know you? Like, do you understand? And then these ladies, they say to me, One says, ah, We want to know, Uguti, the doctor that helped you. Like, do you trust her? And uh, this doctor. Uh, blah 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 like what did you do i'm i'm thinking where did you see did you see any pictures where did you hear about uh you know my body you know you know my body you know like where did you hear and then this lady says i saw on your on your instagram i'm like did you not read did you not see she's like no i saw i i saw but uh, uh, I just don't. We want to talk like this. Gary, but you are mudimo. Is Kata singage gisati le? He took pazami data yami. Eh, is Kata samo photograph for the entire team behind a photo shoot so that I share with you. There are still people who are stopping me and asking. You will see. I but fit ne dalu eling tere le shame. Go bangi ping and giza mail and genam in gay loot on Cosam. Wenning delele o giza mil. Nifuna bonalaba bason camela manga balebeti, Jim, Jim, Jimmy. Hey, Jimmy, Jimmy. Menang yet, Jimmy, vele, 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 mina, soon, je soon. Sang the dirty ten lines of well, Jimmy, but no maintainer, a sang it hand. Do you understand? Sang so go maintainer, a sang it hand. Okay. Let me add on what I've shared already on the journey. When I did my body assessment, I need to corner. There's two things about your body. You need to do your blood type and you need to do your body type. So when the doctors, because I spoke to many doctors before um, my, 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 my procedure. So I asked and I was like, it possibly it's or a time frame. Cause vele vele, I've been a person who's working out, but I'm just not getting that flat mark. And then, eh, 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 look, your your you cannot have a, a flat stomach, unfortunately. Eh, they 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 you cannot and then eh, lose your flat stomach because when you are pregnant, your collagen got destroyed. And it's like an elastic. So, if it's, you understand, the elastic, it's like an elastic, it's like an elastic, elastic, it's like an elastic, it's like an elastic, you cannot stitch it back together. So, the only thing is, these are your options. Baba, 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 my options, oh, tak, oh, ba, no, guest, oh, ba, no, ba, then I chose the one as well. Sana nam nom zimbawam. Then that's why. Then that's why I did. And me sharing this in Giakela Banta, please. Oh, Dr. Filida. In Giakela Banta, my message looks like I don't have to explain myself. No, no, no. I'm not explaining myself. I'm just sharing because that's me. Yeah, that's. You understand? If every few weeks they were asking, yes, imagine, like you imagine, just imagine. Oh, you know, it's very important. Uguti in society, you are able to converse and choose your words you use. Choices of words are very important in life. Gukono mu muto zamu is expressa akulume eni intogantu uya beta uya understand. So, so it's very important to empower yourself as a human being living on this earth 
uh, articulate yourself very well think before you speak uh, and um etiquettes being etiquettes na lokhu isingisi but ukuba ne etiquettes a life in do you understand it's very important because now e etiquette is what glues the society together don't ask me these nonsense nyana things please i beg eh zanela thank you so much my darling wave wigs <laughs> Utaisa ma frontal ilwe munu. We wave wigs. Hi, SR squad. You guys, like, Konto says that she obviously, like, did her body. And she worked on herself with her own money. And then after that, um, she decided, you know what, let me come out and tell people my journey. Maybe that will help someone. Maybe some people also want to change some things in their bodies. So she decided to hire a photographer. She paid the photographer with her own money, right? Then obviously she had to travel. You know, petrol is very, very, very expensive. Then after that, she hired a makeup artist she bought an expensive dress and then she took the pictures she used her data to upload the picture and then she wrote in the caption obviously with her own fingers and took her time and obviously you know she had to like mention the doctor's job on her body she had to like detail everything she posted those pictures on instagram facebook twitter so that people get the information but still today when she goes out people are still like asking her the same questions over and over and over and over again and that really is just like annoying her and she is fuming and asking people to stop asking her about her body who did her body because she did tell you guys and she also said that one day she was at town and some lady called her and then asked her, like, where did she do her body? And then, like, Ongo said, I just asked her, like, how did you know? Like, where did you see that I did my body? Then the lady said, I saw on Instagram. Then, like, Ongo asked her, asked her, rather, then you didn't read the, the caption, didn't you read? Because I wrote everything there. That is just so annoying, you guys. But anyway, as our squad, do comment down below and let me know what do you think about this.